A typical non-coding use of Git and GitHub is to manage CSV spreadsheets. And we'll see a little bit more later what exactly a CSV spreadsheet is. But before we do that, I want to comment that editing is best done on CSV files using either LibreOffice or OpenOffice. These are both uh, free and open source software. So if you're serious about editing CSV files, I recommend that you download them um, and use those over Excel. It is possible to use Excel to edit CSV files, and I will show that in this example since that is the software that most people have available to them. Um, you just have to make sure that when you save the file, you save it with the as a CSV and not with the normal XLSX file extension. The reason I don't recommend Excel is that it's unreliable when it does date conversions. Excel is very good at guessing what you want to do, and if it guesses correctly, that's great. In the case of CSVs, it assumes that anything that has a dash in it is a date, and so if you have things like code numbers that have dashes in them, it will try to convert them into dates automatically, and there's no way to prevent it from doing that. So the problem with is Excel uh, tries to read your mind and does things to the CSV files that you don't want. LibreOffice and OpenOffice both will not mess with what's in your, your uh, CSVs. It will show you exactly what's there and not change anything. It is also possible to edit a CSV file as raw text, and we'll see what that means in a minute. Um, and some hardcore coders are very uh, adamant about uh, doing editing CSVs this way. I don't recommend it because one of the issues with CSV files is there has to be special handling if you have characters like quotation marks and commas. And if you edit the files uh, manually as raw text, uh, you often make mistakes. And using software like LibreOffice or OpenOffice, it automatically takes care of handling those special characters for you and the mistakes generally don't end up happening. Since I said that this was going to be uh, a project to teach people how to use spreadsheets, you can see I've opened up Microsoft Excel here. And so let's just um, create some content here. Okay, so I've just put some random content in here. Now, I need to save this and I want to save it in my repository. So I need to navigate there. Um, in this case, I'll click on GitHub and then project one. And I'm going to call this um, spreadsheet. This system with Git and GitHub does not work very well for proprietary file formats with a lot of complicated information, like for example, um, Excel files. So there's actually a very simple format I can save this in. So if instead of saving it as an Excel workbook, I save it as a CSV UTF-8 comma delineated CSV file, that will be my choice. I will go ahead and save it. It's changed it to spreadsheet, spreadsheet dot csv. Now if I go and click on to my repository, I can see that it has recognized that the spreadsheet is now there. And if I click on this, it will show me what the docu what the CSV document looks like. CSV stands for comma separated values and you can see that a CSV file is really just um, each row on a line of text with commas separating each one of the items there. So this um, spreadsheet is rendered in Excel like this, but as a text file, it's actually like this.